Now to the Nigerian elections and the Electoral Commission there has announced the governing party candidate Bola Tinubu as the winner of Saturday's disputed presidential election. He took 8.8 .8 million votes, that's 36.6% of the total. That left him comfortably ahead of his main rival Atiku Abubakar, who polled 29% with 7 million votes. And the third candidate, who was seen as having a chance of winning, Peter Obi, took 6.1 million votes, just over 25%. Our West Africa correspondent, Mayeni Jones, has been closely following the results. So after several days of waiting, Nigerians now have a clearer picture of who their next president might be. Bola Ahmed Tinubu, the candidate of the ruling All Progressives Congress, uh, appears to have won the most amount of votes in these presidential elections. This result comes amidst a lot of controversy surrounding the vote, uh, with the opposition party saying they've got evidence that the new electronic voting system that was used in Saturday's polls was faulty, uh, that there were issues with some of the machines that were deployed to polling stations around the country and they've asked the Electoral Commission to do a uh, re-election. Uh, the Commission says that there is a channel through which these parties can go if they have any issues with the votes, they can go through the courts once the announcement has been made, but for now it's standing by its results, it's sticking with it. Uh, there's been a lot of confusion amongst the voting public here in Nigeria, walking through Lagos today, lots of people questioning why it's taken so long to get results that were supposed to start trickling in uh, on Saturday Saturday after polls closed but didn't really come out until 24 hours later. That's led to a lot of suspicion in a country that already has a big history of vote buying and vote rigging.